Oh, dude, the same thing I just did is make it on to the next round. That's really all you can do. What was your reaction to the men's 100 and kind of how does that kind of set your mindset of what this 200 is going to be like? Uh, well, everybody who competed in a 100 not really competing in 200, but I mean, I think them guys, they did great. I mean, we had, what, the top two fast times in the world? Or top three? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, yeah something like that. So, I mean, congrats to them guys for making the team. Do you think the 200 is going to also have a lot of that uh, firepower? Yeah. Yeah, it is. You have only run one 200 this year. This is your second. Just in this, what was the reason for only doing one two leading up to the U.S. champs? I mean, just get a body some rest. I'm not really trying to run a lot. Um, I'm trying to save some for Worlds and here, so that's the only reason I didn't run that, that many means. Was that your decision or something you talked about with your coaches? Yeah, it was just a uh, uh, coach's decision. I mean, but a week before that, I ran 100, so I was just like, I just give my body a rest before I go into the um, U.S. champs. Do you feel like you're in the same kind of shape as when you ran 1949? Yes. Yeah. Do you expect to run in that range um, tomorrow? Not really. I mean, not if I don't have to. If I have to, it's going to come down to that. But right now, I'm just trying to make the, the rounds. When you approach these next two rounds, is there a certain – do you kind of – Look at certain athletes of where you are in your lanes. Like, are you kind of looking at what Noah's doing? Like, how do you approach these races when you go up against these big guys? I mean, going up against the big guys, you really don't want to focus too much on them because they're going to be there. You got to focus on yourself. They're never going to be in the bad. They're never going to be behind you unless you're just running a good race at the time. When, when, they always gonna be there. when Noah ran his 19.6 in New York, does that excite you to get to race him? Or what do you think when you see him run that? I mean, I mean, I was happy for him, but I don't really know what to say. I mean, he did run fast. You can't take it away from him, but I was just at an icon right now. I was, I'm just chilling. Right what do you think it's going to take uh, to win uh, tomorrow? Time was. Um, to, to the semis? No, just in, in the final. Oh, I forgot. Finals is tomorrow. Probably like... <laughs> Um, just to make the team? No, to uh, win. I give it a 19-6, like nine, or 19-6-5, one of them times. M mentally coming into this meet, how is it different from last year? Because obviously there are more expectations on you in 2022. It's the same, just making the team, that's it. And I really don't think it's really big expectations for me. I just gotta make the team. You don't feel like there's any expectations on you? Not really, no. Have you ever had to run a semi in a final and you know, have a 200 in the same day? Um, I ran a prelim and semi in Tokyo. But that's probably the only time I doubled in a day. Thanks, All right, thank you. Appreciate it.